what's up guys? How you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome today to a new Legend review here on FIFA 17 Ultimate Team. Let's take a look at one of the favourites, Legend Stoichkov. Haristo Stoichkov is a Bulgarian legend and of course is 90 rated on FIFA 17. He's got crazy, crazy stats. 84 pace, 87 dribbling, 88 shooting, 85 passing and 82 physical. You don't see many players out there with 580 plus stats. He's also 5 foot 10 left footed with 4 star skill moves but only a 3 star weak foot. Now I've got a couple of different squad options for you guys. Of course you can play him in any team you want because he will as a legend link to anyone. Um, I fit him into my Premier League side which has got lots of special players but the side I actually played him in was in a two striker formation, a 4-3-1-2 team um, where his strike partner was the second in form Al Sommer. Other special players in this team are the SBC version of Bellerin and Emre Chan, and ones to watch Renato Sanchez. So. Taking a little look at Stoichkov's in-game stats, I was really, really impressed. They're amazing across the board. Loads of high 80 stats and some 90s, of course. These are only going to get boosted even more if you use them on that basic chemistry style. Or if you want to go all out as a striker, like what I did, I played them with the Hunter chemistry style, which boosted his pace and his shooting drastically. He goes up to 96 pace and 97 shooting, as well as keeping that 87 dribbling and 85 passing, and good physical as well, which is exactly what I wanted. Now, there are a couple of negatives about Stoichkov. There are a lot of positives, but we'll get those negatives out of the way first. He feels like a really small player to me when I'm in-game. Um, he is actually 5'10", which is, I would say, average, but he does feel like a, a small player, so I didn't, I didn't really notice... Uh, any aerial ability with this guy, so his height could be a little bit of an issue for you. Um, and the other thing is, he's a predominantly left-footed player. I noticed it quite quite a lot. I think I scored one goal on his right foot, um, and that was almost a struggle. So I would definitely recommend staying with the stronger foot because his three-star weak foot is just that it is quite weak. Um, but he has a lot of positives that we really need to talk about. Uh, he was a really impressive legend, actually. He's not one that I use very often, but I seem to remember really enjoying him in FIFA 16 as well. And it sort of transferred over to FIFA 17. He's great again this year. His acceleration is phenomenal. Um, his sprint speed, not so much, but it really is that acceleration you notice. Uh, and like I said earlier, he feels like quite a small player on this game. And he's got like decent ag uh, agility and balance that I notice uh, he has this like low center of gravity. He's able to twist and turn very much like, I don't know, strikers like Aguero do. You know, those smaller guys which really um, have good balance and just be are able to turn awesomely quick, which is great. It's exactly what I was after with this guy. Uh, his positioning was also top notch. In a two striker formation, he was the one that I was playing the balls through to because out of out of both of them, he made better runs uh, than Al Sommer did, in my opinion. Uh, and I was I was sort of expecting that as well. He's a higher rated legend, of course. Um, but one thing you get with Stoichkov is aggression. This guy, he, he goes in. He's sort of always ready. You know, you can actually. I would imagine you could play this guy at Cam quite happily, and he would also help your midfield out in terms of like defensive ability. Um, his stat isn't great. But he's, he's got this like bulldog approach, which I think could definitely help. And would definitely open up the option of playing him anywhere from cam to striker. His dribbling and ball control are almost second to none. They're probably the best part about him. He, he's, his first touch is great. And then his dribbling ability is just fantastic. I specifically like the LTRT dribbling because you are able to change direction, move really quickly um, and just burst past those defenders with that. His strength is something that you wouldn't expect on, on this type of player, this almost flair type of player, but he most definitely has it and you can see that in his 82 physical. And then finally, his shooting is really impressive as well. Uh, like I said earlier, I wouldn't recommend the right foot, but he does have an absolute cannon of a left peg. So there you have it, guys. I actually really enjoyed the Bulgarian legend, Haristo Stoichkov. Hopefully you guys now know whether or not he's right for your ultimate team. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.